Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. It's beautiful here. Beautiful here in sunny Florida, 77 degrees, 8.20 a.m. on this beautiful Tuesday. Today is surgery day, so I thought I would jump on really quick while we're driving. Um, we have about an hour to go. We have our precious cargo in the back seat. We have Blackie, Poppy, and Snowflake. They're so confused right now. They're such good passengers. They have not made a peep. They're in the back. I don't know if you can really see. I'm trying to do this while I'm driving. Shelly's in the back with all three in a big bed. Um, they're all getting vetted today. They're getting their blood work. They're getting microchipped, um, their vaccine and neutered. So it's gonna be a very big day for all three of these beautiful, sweet, precious babies. We were just saying how absolutely amazing they are. Um, they're just absolutely perfect. There's not a, a negative thing that we can say about them. These are the three dogs that were owner surrendered to our organization. I'm sorry if it's freezing up, I'm out in horse country. So we've been I waited to go live because we were on some serious dirt roads. It was so bumpy. And I'm driving hands-free, so my phone is in the holder, so I don't have to worry about not paying attention to the road. It's all about Eight being miles. safe. Turn right onto South State Road 7. Um, take this out for a minute before I shut down, uh, but don't know the sun is glaring so it's really hard for me to see what's going on in the back but um, all three babies are in the back and like I said we are on our way to Broward our old stomping ground where we're gonna get all of the babies vetted um, and like I said they were so confused you know harnessing them up and leashing and putting them in the car uh, but they've been really good right Shelly they're so excellent. Not a peep. Uh, Shelly gave them a night, a, a late night dinner so they wouldn't be too hungry this morning. Around 11 o'clock, they had a meal. Uh, no accidents in the room. They came right out this morning. They did their peepees and their poopoos before we headed, uh, you know, on, got, got on the road in the car and got them loaded up. So it's just so beautiful right now. Look at that sky. Look at that sky. How beautiful gorgeous absolutely gorgeous but I will do another quick live video at the animal hospital when we arrive in about an hour um, but I just wanted to jump on and say good morning and ask everybody to please turn right. uh, send us your prayers for these babies again they have to have blood work and we're praying that there is no problems as far as their blood work, such as um, any tick-borne diseases or heartworm. Uh, we're praying to God everything come back, comes back negative so we can proceed forward with all three surgeries. Um, God forbid, I don't even want to put it out there in the universe. Um, so I'm going to stay positive and leave it at that. And we'll go from there. Can you see them? I don't know if you get the sun. You can see how bright the sun is. So it's really hard for me to flip the phone. Um, Which way is that facing? What? Oh, it's facing out. It's facing out, but when I put it on this way, it actually, you know what, Shelly? I'm gonna uh, hand you my phone, yeah. and maybe you can just the right lane to turn onto South State Road Seven. Show the babies. Yes. Yeah. Shelly's gonna yes. show. You can talk, Shelly. Say good morning. Morning. <laughs> Papa. Turn right. Hello. Snowflake. Hi, baby. Say good morning. Say good morning. There's are the babies. There you have it. I'm at a red light. Oh, right. Oh, right. There's the babies. <laughs> so, again, um, like I said, we have a lot of traffic. We're getting ready to get on the wonderful 95 and get these babies safely to their vet appointment. 
uh, please make a donation if you can. The donation link is on this video. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Everybody's up early this morning. I know, we've been up since 5. <clears throat> is Auntie Susan on? Um, oh, Auntie Susan Asowich, if you are on here, you know, Shelly and I were saying Poppy is going to be so freaked out by wearing a cone after his surgery. So we were talking about how we wanted to get him like one of those little surgical suits so he would not have to wear um, a cone. And what do you think? Susan Asowich ordered the surgical suit and it will be here this afternoon. So when we get back to the rescue house he will not have to wear a cone. The other two will be fine, I know for sure. But um, Auntie Susan, we love you, and we so appreciate you so, so very much. So thank you. Thank you. We'll let you know when it arrives safely. And, yeah, we're going to get on the road. I want to pay attention. Like I said, there's a lot of traffic going on here. So flying out. Um, in 15 miles, turn left onto Yamato Road. I'll check in with you when we get to the vet's office. So please donate and please send your love and prayers for all of our three precious, precious babies that are going in for surgery. Um, it's going to be very scary for them. You know, they're just getting settled with us. They've only been with us a little over two weeks after being surrendered by their owner. <clears throat> They've really settled in beautifully. We are looking for forever homes for all three of these perfect, perfect angels. They're tiny, they're sweet, they're loving. They're just off the chart perfect. There's just not enough words. Good morning, good morning. All right, guys, signing off. Amy and Shelly with our precious cargo. Please donate, please pray. Send your prayers, 100 plus abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida.